Yokohama, Japan. Breaking news now. 400 quarantined Americans held on the Diamond Princess cruise ship for more than two weeks are now evacuating. NBC's Janice Mackey Frayer on the ground with more. Janice, what's the situation? Well, we know that uh, Americans were told to be ready this evening to pack a carry-on to get all of their baggage ready. They would be transported by buses to Haneda Airport, which is about 20 minutes from here, where that special chartered flight will be waiting to take them back to the U.S. We know the process is underway here. Passengers uh, were told to prepare. There are buses that are lined up. Uh, there have been announcements made on the ship that we've been able to, to, to hear. And we just had uh, a number of military trucks uh, drive past us. The drivers in their hazmat suits uh, suggesting that the, the military aspect of this, uh, of controlling the transport of these people to the airport uh, is in place. Uh, what we know is that people can expect to spend several hours waiting at an airport hangar. Uh, everyone needs to be screened for symptoms before they can get on that flight. Only healthy people will be allowed to go. If somebody is shown Showing signs of symptoms, uh, they will remain here. They will be tested to, for the virus, and if necessary, they will be hospitalized. That's already the case for at least 40 Americans who are being treated in hospitals here. And there are also some people who have opted not to get on this flight, Ali. Uh, if that's the case, they will remain on the ship until Japan's authorities end the quarantine. And only when they test negative for the virus will they be allowed to come off the ship. It doesn't mean Mean they're allowed to go home, though. U.S. officials were very adamant in saying that for anyone who chooses to stay, they cannot return to the U.S. until at least March the 4th. Uh, that would be two weeks from the 19th of February, which is the date that Japan's authorities expect to end the quarantine here. But with another 70 confirmed cases announced today, 67 cases yesterday, 355 passengers infected on board. It's unclear whether Japan's authorities are going to stick to that 14-day uh, quarantine. All right, who's Allie? left on the, who will be left on that uh, cruise ship and what happens to them? Well, everyone who remains on the ship will be here again until at least the 19th of February. Uh, that's when the official 14-day quarantine is over, and it's up to Japan's authorities uh, to get them off. There are other planes that will be coming. Uh, Canada is sending a plane. There will be a plane coming from Hong Kong to repatriate those passengers. Uh, for Japanese passengers, they will, of course, remain here. Uh, and everyone else, again, will be tested before they get off the ship before they'll be able to set foot in Japan. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.